Hello, um, today I will be presenting on Amazon. I will be presenting a proposal on their um, increasing their presence in China. Amazon established itself in China in 2004 when it overtook a company called Joyo.com, which is already a Chinese company. Their mission statement, we seek to be Earth's most customer-centric company for four primary customer sets, consumers, sellers, enterprises, and content creators, is their inspiration for their expansion into new markets, including global markets such as China. However, ever since their establishment, they have yet to establish a meaningful presence within the market. They have encountered such obstacles as strong domestic competitors and are competing against the Chinese e-commerce giant Alibaba. Besides that, they only hold 2.7% of Chinese e-commerce market. In comparison to Alibaba, which holds a much larger share, it's, they want to increase that share. Um, the company ended 2014 fis fiscal year with a $7 million increase in losses since, since, their, since 2013, which amounted to a total loss of $126 million. Um, besides the, the, their, comp their competition, they're running into strict government regulations, which bars foreign companies from owning but a minority interest in domestic technology, technology companies or data centers. What this means is that entities essential to the functions of a web company must be majority owned by Chinese businesses, which further propels domestic rivals and keeps down Amazon's market share. Um, but there is hope. These are the projected Chinese consumer trends for the next few years. In 2013, there was only 18 million e-commerce consumers and spending about $35 billion. In 2014, they expect that price, or they expect that amount to double, and then to be spending about $163 billion. What I propose is an executive team to be established along with the, the new hub that is already underway in Shanghai's free trade zone area in China. What this will allow them to do is to collect data and normalize it, develop policies, get support for their decisions, find any alternatives, and ultimately come to a decision much quickly, much quicker if they, than if they had to get back to U.S. headquarters for approval. Chinese consumers are increasingly shopping in the U, uh, on U.S. e-commerce websites. As you can see here, 84% of survey consumers have shopped on U.S. e-commerce websites. In comparison to other, other um, countries such as Hong Kong, Japan, U.K., and Australia, the U.S. is much more popular on, on websites. What I propose is a marketing strategy that will expand on the competitor's weaknesses, which is Alibaba, who do not provide U.S. goods, and when they do, they are accused of being fake. Um, Amazon's strengths are that it has high-quality products, and it will get those products to consumers much more quickly with a new hub in Shanghai. Um, what this will do is it will target the, that, that pool of Chinese consumers. This will, the executive team will cost about $830,000 a year, while the marketing strategy will, con, will um, cost $965,000 a year. Um, with the benefit, it would be we would be targeting a pool of three, 36 million consumers. Thank you for your consideration.